Hello, my name is Doug. I'm showing you a piece of the ore I brought back from the claim today. It's actually a pretty small piece out of the hillside there. I've got what looks to be a whole mountain full of it. I'm typically a placer miner, but yeah, I grabbed this. I was going to do a little water feature in it until I noticed all the metals in there. And, well, that might be opening me up to a whole other type of project here. We're viewing this through a 200 times digital microscope I got off of eBay for about $25. Pretty good deal. Just yeah. So. Well, I'm just showing, I, I believe these silvery metals are Galena deposits. The area it came from, the Silver Valley, is definitely known for silver. Galena type ores along with zinc. Um, and gold. Not so much gold, but definitely some up there. There's a nice chunk of it. This piece we're examining came off of a 26 pound rock, which was half the slab I was going to use for my water feature until I figured out it had all this cool shiny stuff in. Well, if you're anything like me, you see something shiny, that just totally sidetracks me. Like, ooh, what's that? So anyway, I'm just kind of cruising along the rock here, going up. These are the, uh, these are right by the edges here. We're just kind of tracing the outside edges of the rock. And here we're going to go in, going a little deeper into the rock. Here's where I think I'm seeing a little bit of micron gold. I'll try to zoom it in just a little better. These lighter pockets. And it's very, very, very small. It's something that would, I'm guessing, most certainly have to be leached. So that's another question I got for anyone watching this: is okay, I found it. Now what? Obviously, I'm not going to start a cyanide leach plant. Um, well, and maybe I will if the values are there. But um, I'm guessing next steps, obviously, to go ahead and try to mark out the whole area, get get stuff assayed, and stake all I can, and then probably contact the big boys see if I can get a big mining firm to come up here shoot might have to call Todd Hoffman sounds of things he might be uh, might be needing a new spot to prospect and these colors are absolutely phenomenal Todd Hoffman if you happen to watch this Come on up, I'll buy you a big fat steak, buy you all the beer you want, we'll have a good old time. I really, really get a kick out of you, I like your drive. Anyway, this is the bad end of my rock, we're coming back around, some of the colors are absolutely phenomenal. Um, definitely going to be some pyrite in there, I, I realize all the gold color stuff's not going to be gold. Even the pyrite in this area seems to have a pretty good uh, content of gold in there. So anyway look at those colors that's just gorgeous this whole rock was really neat broke it apart it broke on a natural fissure um, thought I had found uh, a fossil so I contacted a buddy over in the UK that works at the uh, Natural History Museum and he had informed me that it was not a fossil it was a mineralization growth and that was pretty common and yeah, that led to me busting it up more. So, anyway, thanks for watching. Hope this helped. And if you have any comments or any advice, by golly, I'd be happy to listen to it.